here selling my 1986 Toyota van wagon. It's running and driving, clean title in hand, clean California title. Registration is up to date. It's a original five speed manual transmission. Um, recently had service done to the mortar. New spark plugs, uh, regular tune up, spark plugs, air filter, oil. Um, I also added new brakes in the past two days. I changed out the front brake pads. That's brand new brake pads. I have receipts and all that to prove it. Um, that shows it has 240,000 miles on the chassis. The motor itself was a replacement and it was, I think the previous owner told me it was rebuilt around I think a hundred and hundred and ten thousand miles ago. So it has a hundred and ten thousand on the mortar, two forty on the on the van itself. Um it has the original cassette deck aftermarket. I think it's a Kenwood tape player. Um seats, pretty old passenger carpet, it's pretty old, headliner still all there. You got this uh Long uh, rear view mirror, it's more of an old school type of look as well. Old school steering wheel, door panels themselves are pretty good. On the bottom is just missing the little carpet patch. Door, panel, door panels are pretty, pretty good. Windows, no cracks, no missing windows. Um, I've been working on it little by little, a sliding windows on the sides both in the middle the back ones don't pop open or anything just these slide this way this one slides back I did add aftermarket wheels on there they're 15s by 8 brand new tires all around nice wheels a nice lip on them I was painting the starting to rebuild the whole front end I repainted the whole grill Painted the headlights yellow with the yellow tint on the glass, on the high beams. Runs good, doesn't leak oil. I also changed out the fan clutch on the mortar. The old one was already worn out. All those patches that you see, these are Bondo. Just the sand and, and the primer to get it ready for paint. If, that's, that was my plan, but right now I gotta, I gotta move it along, get a couple of bills, and this is my third car, my van project that I was working on. So, but I I drive it pretty much, pretty much daily. I mean, take it to errands, whenever I wanna go pick up some stuff or the wheels. Um, everything doors are open good. Got the back trunk. The seats actually fold out to a bed. It's got uh, two benches on the back. I'll open it up right now. See that. And the rear uh, plastic character here with the reverse lights on. The other one's good. No cracks. Let <laughs> pop this one open. And all the doors lock up with the key and open as well. It's my dog pull right there. Seats in the back, no tears in the seating area. Same right here. This one's just a brown one. It's not the original color on it, but it was replaced at one point from another van. It's a brown tan color. Hey, come down, boy. I said it has all the all the fixings, dome lights working. So the seat falls out into a bed. Got switches for the air for the rear passengers. 
does have AC, but you have to recharge the system. So it's an original five speed. Let's start it up right now. Let's see it run. Starts right up, the Toyota buzzing sound. All the gauges work, even your gas gauge, your temp gauge. It's all working, your speedo works. Because it has an AC mode. And also, this pops out of it. It's to turn on the rear AC. Turns it on right there. It blows cold, but you gotta recharge it to make it work. That's how it should. Oh, the dash underneath is pretty cracked, but just have the cover on it. I'll show you the latches. You check out your mortar underneath. There's the fuel injected stock mortar as stock as it could be. Dusty, but runs real good, smooth as you can hear. No knocking, even the gears they go all in, no grinding. The five speed is a SR5 EF5 uh, EF5 uh, van. Doesn't overheat. That's the locks sake. Lock up your, your head, let's call it. So come check it out. Just moving it along, have the title registration. Some test drivers, like I said, brand new brakes. You can fill them out, they're brand new. Doesn't rub on any of the tires. It's a little bit lower in the back. It's still lower the front a little bit more. The torsion bars. And the car text if you're interested. Thank you.